An interesting fact about Serbia is that locals believe that they would not receive luck or favour from the gods if they do not treat their guests well. So why wouldn't you want to visit? Hi, my name is Morgan and this is Best Kept Secrets, what you need to know before travelling to Serbia. Serbia is located in the southeast of Europe, to the west of the Republic of Bosnia and Herzegovina and Croatia. Serbia adjoins Hungary to the north, Romania and Bulgaria to the east, North Macedonia to the south, and Montenegro to the southwest. Serbia does not recognise Kosovo as an independent country, although that's to the south as well. The best time to visit Serbia is generally from March to May, and then September to October, avoiding the heat of June, July and August. December is the best time to go for skiing, and Kapalnik is the country's major ski resort, and night skiing is an option for travellers who want an adventure. There are two international airports in Serbia, with one of the main being in Belgrade. The land border is very easy to cross by buses, trains or car, as with most European countries. The currency in Serbia is the dinar, there are 146 dinars to one pound. The average price of a beer is 160 dinars. They speak Serbian in Serbia, although not to worry, as in a lot of the big cities and touristy areas there's lots of English speakers. Zdravo is a common greeting, and the most important phrase of course is how much is a beer, which is koliko je pivo. Like a lot of European countries, the best way to get around Serbia is by car. If you're new to Serbia and its roads, the safer option could be travelling by bus. The railway network is extensive and cheap, but the trains are very old, slow and unreliable. Buses are generally more expensive than trains, but more frequent and faster. Some random quick fire facts about Serbia. Serbia is one of the world's biggest exporters of raspberries. There's a river called Yir, because you guessed it, it's 365 metres long. Lazar the Serb invented the first mechanical watch, not the Swiss. Serbia, famous for its nightlife and monasteries, home to the largest gorge in Europe, and relatively untouched in terms of modern tourism, the Friska Gora mountains share the boundaries of, with Croatia and is called the Jewel of Serbia. It consists of the Friska Gora Park and is full of wineries and vineyards. For the adventurer there may be many places for hiking and climbing. Mount Stara Planina is the place where there are more than 90 beautiful waterfalls, most of which were discovered no earlier than 2012. Serbia's most interesting landscapes can be found on the slopes of Mount Radar, known as Devil's Town. This area is home to a bizarre red rock formation, which was once considered by the locals to be the result of devils fighting one another. I hope you learned something new about travelling to Serbia, and if you have, comment below what you didn't know. Remember to like, comment and subscribe as it really helps the channel out. Thanks for watching, and comment below what you want me to do next.